is Sports Center. Welcome to Sports Center, Victoria Arlen and Christina Alexander with you as we near the end of the NFL's regular season. We've already seen another head coach lose his job. There could be another Peyton headed to the Broncos. We've got the latest from Denver, Victoria. A lot to get to in the next hour, Christina. Our coach will get to weigh in on how the Eagles and Dolphins should protect their quarterbacks. Plus, we've got reports from all four teams yeah. in the college football playoff. But we're going to begin with our developing story surrounding Tua Tagovailoa. An Tagovail SEC championship is great. A national championship, even better. Back-to-back -back national championships, unreal. Georgia has a chance to do just that. First, they'll have to face Ohio State in the Chick-fil-A Peach Bowl. Jen Latta sat down with Kirby Smart to talk about his team's mindset heading into the CFP semifinals. On SportsCenter, Herm, still focusing on the Chargers. What do you hope to see they improve on offensively as they prepare for the playoffs? Of, of really uh, uplifting their football team. Yeah, no slowly, surely, but just in time as well. The Chargers currently the sixth seed and would face the Bengals. So let's switch now. despite their recent losses. Well, you know, no one expected them to even be the in the week. We saw that storyline with both New York teams, as you said, under scrutiny. But the Giants rank six in total rushing yards this season behind Jones and Barkley. Herm Edwards, thank you so much with the insight on SportsCenter. Do it for this edition of SportsCenter. Who do you got this weekend? It's really exciting, but we were talking about it a little bit, right? Yeah. It's exciting to see what the underdogs can really do. Let's yeah. Over here. We are. Team underdogs, so TCU and Ohio.